What is up, YouTube? Dragon Taco Seven here, and today I'm bringing you guys an updated version of my Plant Synchro deck. Um, the reason I'm doing this is because a brand new card got released um, over the weekend, and um, it does help with the consistency of the deck a lot. You know, it made it bumped it up from like tier 50 to tier 49. That's really nice. Um, well, you know, aside, there's like one card. One card that really helps in the uh, main deck, and there's another one that really helps in the extra deck. So, um, yeah, hooray for plants. So, first off, uh, three Lone Fire, uh, Dandy, Spore, and Glow Bulb. I ended up taking out the vanilla because I'm not playing the Unexpected Die version anymore. That glare is really bad. And I know I've seen like some people still play it even without Unexpected Die. Um, just because it's a level 4 tuner, but I really don't like it. Because, uh, you know, I just don't feel it's worth it if you're not playing any uh, vanilla support. Uh, so, uh, 2 Debris Dragon. Uh, kind of got better because we got a new dragon in the extra deck. Spoiler. Um, then the Perform Age Engine. Uh... I cut down Trick Clown down to one. I just hated drawing the second one. Um, and once I like dumped it um, in the grave, I like never wanted to see it again. Um, I ended up uh, replacing it with uh, Fairy Tail Snow. Um, at the locals, I ended up actually um, twice. I ended up banishing cards from my hand just to summon it off. But uh, both times have ended up paying off, um, which is pretty surprising. Um, I actually went minus two to summon him, but oh well. You gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, then perform mage hip hippo. He's just a level three earth, you know, Malay fodder. Uh, gem knight sapphire debris target as your gem knight for brilliant fusion. Uh, jet synchron. It's like a second bulb. Uh, two card trooper, more melee fodder, and it kind of sets up your grave. There's uh, lots of things you know you want to get in there. You know, fuel up for uh, fairy tale snow, lets you grind. You know, trick clown, jet, any uh, any of the any of your plants. You know the drill. Uh, mathematician, ooh, mathematician for more uh, selective milling, I guess. Thunder King can still be a blowout card against some decks. Uh, Caius, just because, you know, sometimes the tokens linger around and, you know, he might as well get something done. Banish Dante. That never happens, though. Uh, and then uh, two Maxis. Um, then three Super Hippo Carnival. Um, special summons the Hippo. Uh, this guy. From your hand deck or graveyard, um, then you, you have an option to summon uh, perform age to hippo tokens, um, but you never want to do that because it locks you out of the extra deck. So just summon the hippo. Uh, three brilliant fusion, soul charge, and instant fusions for you know revival and stuff. Uh, foolish and one for one always have been plant support. Uh, Twin Twisters for back row, removal, and uh, Regeki. Oh, one more spell. Upstart, because 39 card deck is way too OP. And then I played the only, only three traps in the deck. Uh, warning and two strikes. So, extra deck, uh, Malay of the Trees, um, Kestel, and Emerald as the only exceeds that I play. Uh, Norden and Seraph for fusions and for like actual synchros. Uh, Ultimaya, uh, Formula, Librarian, <coughs> Excel, uh, Charge Warrior, and Core Dragon. Funny thing is, uh, I was able to bring out Ultimaya with both, you know, two level fives and level sixes. Uh, that was pretty cool because I never summoned him with the level sixes before. Yeah, Core Dragon is pretty neat. It also like ditches cards that um, 
like that you might draw and you just want to get engraved. And it lets you draw a card like when it's sent to the grave, so that's pretty cool. Uh, Black Rose, my only level 7. I took out Clear Wing, I just didn't think it was good. Um, Hot Red. Um, I played again, I think it was uh, Extra Deck Marnix. Yeah, and like he had a field of that big rank 8 guy. I forgot its name. Uh, Crystal Wing and like some other Monarch. Uh, I had. I was playing, and then I like baited it out his uh, crystal wing negation, then made Ultimaya summon this and like blew him away. It was pretty nice. Uh, finally got the crystal wing. Hey, and then uh, Trish has the last card. Anyway, YouTube, that's the deck. Uh, rate, come subscribe, and uh, I'll try to post up more frequently. Um, so till next time, see ya.